Sup y'all, bring you guys another video. So did you guys know that uh, Sergei Kuzmin recently fought against Igor De Silva over in uh, Moscow, Russia? Uh, fight took place today. I honestly didn't even notice what was happening. I only found out about it um, when I was looking at the uh, schedule for boxing today and tomorrow and I saw Kuzmin's name and I was like, okay, well, he's fighting. And the fight was scheduled for 10 rounds. The fight ended in the 10th round, and it was a BS stoppage, in my opinion. Um, Silva went down, don't get me wrong. He got hurt, he went down, he got up before the 10th count with maybe 2-3 seconds left in the fight, and the referee called off the fight and stopped the fight, and Kuzmin ends up winning this fight. Um, the fight's here on YouTube if you want to see the full fight. Uh, you know, just search up Kuzmin versus Da Silva, and you should be able to find it. And uh, and yeah, it, it went the whole ten rounds. Well, it didn't go the whole ten rounds with one or two seconds left in the fight. Um, but it looked competitive. I thought it was. I didn't score it round by round, but it looked competitive. Um, actually, I thought Silva was doing a great, a very good job boxing. He did get hurt in the middle rounds. I can't remember exactly what round it was. I think it was round number six where he went down. Um, but he was doing pretty well. And if it goes the distance, I, I would have been interested to see how the scorecards, how the judges had it. But I, I thought that, I don't know, man. I thought that that, that stoppage was complete bull. Uh, referee, who's the referee in this fight? Um, yeah, BoxRec has to update it still. They haven't updated it. I don't know how why they haven't updated it. The fight took place at, at least an hour ago now. And they still have yet to update it. But yeah, I wonder who the referee was. Because... Uh, he, he definitely got paid to make sure uh, Sergey Kuzmin won this fight. Because it was very close. And one can make the argument probably that the Silva was winning this fight. Even though, well, with the two knockdowns, I think it would be hard uh, to make him, you know, have the Silva win. But still, man, that stoppage was, was doo-doo, man. That was a bad stoppage. Bad stoppage by the referee. Uh, but with this win... Sergey Kuzmin, at the age of 34 years old now, improves to 16 and 2, 11 wins coming by or 12 wins coming by way of knockout TKO. Um, first win since losing to Michael Hunter and Martin Bacoli. In my opinion, I mean there was a time where Sergey Kuzmin was, you know, a top 15 heavyweight, but now, after watching this fight, I don't think so, man. I, I, don't, I, don't, I think Kuzmin is pretty much on the downhill now. I think it's pretty much almost done. Um, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really see him being much of a threat to the top 15 fighters in the heavyweight division. His opponent, Igor Da Silva, um, was undefeated going to this fight. He was 10-0, 10 wins coming by way of knockout TKO. He suffers his first loss in this one. I think he should actually try to go to 199 pounds, 200 pounds, the cruiserweight division. I feel like with his style and power, I think he might actually be competitive. He might actually make some noise at 200 pounds in the cruiserweight and he's not that far off from making weight. He's 217 from, uh, I mean, he was 217 for this fight against Sergey Kuzmin, so he's 17 pounds away from making 200. So I think he should go move down in weight to cruiserweight and try to compete there. I feel like uh, he'll definitely he'll definitely uh, make some achievements at 200 pounds if he does what you know if he decides to continue fighting. Um, and I'm sure he will. I mean, 29 years old, he'll he'll continue fighting. So anyway. BS stoppage. If you saw the fight, if you saw the full fight, let me know. What did you think about? Who did you have winning? I I, I couldn't watch the whole entire entirety of it. Um, I watch here and there. Um, oh man, I'm watching. I'm watching a fight right now. Uh, yeah, I'm watching the uh, Jay Harris fight right now. Oh man, um, somebody got knocked down. So, oh no way, Jay Harris is about to lose. Oh my goodness. Alright, uh, I gotta go focus on this fight. Uh, let me know what did you guys think about this fight in the comments. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.